if it's okay with you two, I I'm going to go metal detecting. Um, okay. I mean, I know I don't have many options right now because of the snow, but, um... Jump off something high. I gotta get something. Land on something sharp. I know that you're going to miss me. You know what they say. I know. About people who assume... But be strong. I want you to be strong and carry on while I'm gone. We think you're a monster. Be strong. A monster. It's time to detect. Don't let the door hit you. If you find a spot in the middle of winter that is uh, producing on a beach, oh, you go back there. I even invited some friends. All right, beach, you owe me a ring today. I, I like hunted you the last two days, no rings. You owe at least one of us a ring. Here's the deal. Six rings so far in 2021. Goal is 100. But of those 100, uh, here's where the improbability comes in. I need to get at least 50 gold rings. Uh, I have some help. You know, I'm teaming up with Gone Diggin, and we're trying to get 50 gold rings between us. Long story with that, with trash pandas. But I'll let you in on that in another video in the near future. But long story short, we need rings and ideally gold rings. Dimmy, plenty of those. Hi, FDR. Well, there we go. I hunted this beach for two days. Second signal. Taco Bell has been unlocked. That did not take long. I do believe that this is silver, but it rang up at 19. There we go. Taco Bell has been unlocked. It's a little one. 19, I'm glad I dug that. Keep dropping it. Sweet! Look, it's Philip the Knox! There we go. Oh, what is that? Ring! Oh, I guess it is. 19. It looks like the big silver. It's 19 rings already? Uh, no, no, no. Uh, it, it rang up at a 19. I wish it was 19 rings. I see a little golden in color there. I, I mean, it, it's not... Um, looks like it's silver. It's yeah, no, the, the, the gray is silver. But you see the, the little yellowish in there? After thinking that the last one was uh, silver, but it was platinum, it got me thinking. But uh, I mean, all clues do, you know, lend to it to be silver. Yeah, it's got gold in it, but gold doesn't tarnish, brother. Right, right. Yep. Gold comes out with the gold, unless you're at the. Uh... <laughs> well, I've had to. Uh, 10, 10k though. Have you ever gotten something 10k that's yeah, uh, tarnished? I've never gotten a black light. Yeah, never black like this. I hear you. Yeah. That might okay. be like silver, uh, gold plated. Yeah, could be. There you go. Cool. All that's right. Rings are rings. All right. Really quick. Spreadsheet time. Hundred rings. We are up to seven, and we're also moving up pieces of silver found. 46, I do have to test it and tumble it and fix it, but pretty sure that's silver, 46. Okay, here's a close-up of the ring. And this is what I was talking about. It's got the gold, goldish color, but you know, come to think of it, come to look at it really close, that's the silver peeking through there. It's a little goldish there interesting little ring and can't see any signs of um, a engraving but pretty cool fishy fishy thingy thingy Phil just got a coin spill so lots of stuff still here well I thought I got something golden No clue what this is. Rang up the right way. 
I mean, if anything, it's super thin. So we test it. Don't know what it could be from, but we test it. Zinkin at 14. Oh. Hello, everybody. How you doing? Hey, we got John Blake back here. Awesome day out here. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Gotta love the balmy 27 degrees. <laughs> <laughs> It's well, cold. That's what counts. That's right. That's right. And we got a piece of copper. Oh man, 43 zincons yesterday. We're off to a flying start today. Piece of scrap metal. Oh, we got a chain. Possible gold. Although the end looks silver there. But we got a chain. Sweet! Okay, here is a close up. And you can see the difference. Well, I don't know. I don't know. I don't see any. See, that's rusting a little bit. But there's no hint of an engraving there. It's also very light. I thought I saw a discoloration. Maybe not. Hmm. Maybe we should test. Then again, a test will... There we go. Look at this in here. Yeah, it's plated. You can see right there. Gold plated. So a test would make it, um, it would come out positive. It would be like, yeah, it's gold, but no, it's not. It's plated. There we go. We just saw right there. Okay, I just mudlarked this. Look at this. See over by the pin though? I think that this is plated. Then again, it's only the pin part that is uh, showing plating. So that could be a golden earring. I'm being distracted. Hi, Gary. I don't see any engravings here. Uh, I know that thing in the corner looks like an engraving. It's not. Good. What do you think? Is it real or fake? It's all yours. Bye. Oh, we got silver. Hagen does. This is suddenly a deceptively good silver month now, uh, but none of which have been coins. I have zero silver coins this month. And some uh, blang blang. I have my doubts that this is uh, a uh, real diamond in there. But looking at the color, that's some silver. Whoa, nice fake diamond there. This... Mm, I don't know. Oh, there it is. Oh, gravity. Gravity, gravity, gravity. Yeah, we'll have to clean this up, but I'm pretty sure that that's 925. It's a quarter. Okay, I uh, mudlarked this too. It is a bullet. No way. Got the uh, second one of these yesterday. I'll be right there. I think Phil got gold. Yeah, I got the other one of those yesterday. That's crazy. Is it a ring? Yeah. Oh, gold ring! Just 
Oh, snap. Oh, you got gold. Wow, that's heavy, dude. Yeah, no, that, I know it's gold. How old, How uh, deep was that? Uh, right there, I got to the shell layer. Wow. That's a beauty. We got gold. Yes, sir. I might have some too, nothing like that. But, uh, yeah. let's pull it out. I believe this is 24 karat too. Yeah, I think so, looking at the, uh, look at that. I got a little chain. Uh, part of it might be oh, very gold. nice. And I got, uh, here we go. Let's see, where else? Earring. But oh. I think that's plated. This I know is fake. Yeah. You can see the copper in here. This. Look at the edges. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Plated. Yep. Hey, I want you know the real what? thing. All right, man. The trash pandas, we, uh, we might have to conspire with you we want to save the moon but uh absolutely yeah let's see let's see good stuff thanks brother and now we bring you a quick and important product review so this is a reminder do not get the gopro 8 it's got door issues basically the door does not keep the battery in and it cuts out number one that wasn't the problem that I just had. I had a battery go from, I think it could be because of the weather, uh, a battery go from 75% to 3%. So I had to go back to my car. Long story short, I didn't have those issues with the GoPro 7. GoPro 9 is out. I'm considering it because the GoPro 7 was so good, but these issues are making me look into other options. So where were we? Timmy in the scoop. Think on! Earring back. You know, one time somebody said to me, uh, after I found an earring, Hey, can I have my earring back? And I was like, sure. And I handed them that little thing. <laughs> so let's take a look at this. All right, let's get serious. This is a super serious teachable moment here. Any time that I see this much seashells collecting close to the shoreline could be pushing, but it also tells me we could be close to a bottom. And the digging that I've done here, it's very solid, it's very compacted. And this is the area that uh, really it does not fall much further than. Uh, I recently did a video on this, but I have tried digging down. Let's do that just for illustration purposes. And you see, I could stand on this. I'm not, look at this, like a ballerina. I'm not going that much further. There's that compacted shell layer underneath. It's like shell after shell. When it's sand at this area, you won't get as much. Um, of course, stuff could be pushed all the way through and back as well, depending upon wave speed. Uh, yeah, so I've been really searching this area hard and uh, the coins went all the way up. So we have uh, we have a good spot. Yurunk and copper wire. Zinc one. Dimmy. So Phil's a bit better at this than me. And I've been watching where he goes and he's been staying pretty much in this uh, shell area uh, for the entire time. And honestly, this is where I've been, uh, this is where the gravity is pulling me to. Sometimes you see this at the high tide line. It's not the same. It's not the same. I mean, each one of these, the flow characteristics of them, look at them moving right now. You know, they just move. But you see a whole clump down low. You want to be down low. Oh, snap. Look at this. Earring, I guess. I don't know if it's silver. This rang up at a four. So we got to clean it up and figure it out. That's pretty sweet. What's really interesting is this is specific to this section of beach. You know, in between these two jetties, it is not like this elsewhere. Whoa! This is the biggest fake diamond I've ever seen. 
<laughs> this is the king of bling right here. That's me. <laughs> bling, bling, bling. Uh, it's not quite 24K gold, but uh, this is the biggest fake diamond I've ever seen. Holy crap. <laughs> Part of an earring. Damn. I've been having a good earring day. Well, your daughter's going to be happy with that. Yeah, she is. That's for you, Gabs. This thing. This is a chandelier. You want a chandelier on your ear? Oh man, this is bling times bling cubed. Look at that, it's like a disco ball. <laughs> beach glass. Maybe I should start collecting beach glass. It's kind of cool. Yeah, that's a nice piece. Yeah, here we go with some more beach glass. I'm like debating with myself. Should I keep it or not? Yeah, I'll keep it. What the hell? I've moved on to another section of the beach and this is very different. I'm in the water even further in. Look at all the sand. It's like an island of sand pushing up. So we got beach back over there and the slope and there's this area down here and I'm curious. That's why I'm here. But there seems to be nothing. Whoa, I just unlocked an entire Wendy's restaurant. Wendy's. Has been unlocked. Look at this. Jonathan, this has your name written all over it. <laughs> So this beach has a really interesting dynamic. All of the stuff that I'm finding, with the exception of this Zinken, was one-sided. And I think that that has to do with the jetties and the flow that happens uh, with the jetties. It's, it's almost like the water, let's see if we could take a look, is pushing over. I'm going to leave my beach scoop for a second. But the direction of the water comes in over there look at the direction of the flow I can see it right now it's going from right to left see that watch this see the sand come off my scoop it's going this way and it's just catching all the way over there so you know I'm not an expert on flow dynamics by any means but uh, <laughs> I'll call that metal detecting flow dynamics. It's an unofficial science. That's what I see. So look at this too. The waves over here, not reaching the beach. The waves over on that side, they are reaching the beach. Big difference. See, over here, not reaching the beach. Look at that wave after wave over here, reaching the beach. I'm heading over there. So is Phil. <laughs> And this side has thousands more shells. I mean, there were targets over there. That car that I found that unlocked Wendy's was over there. But this is like next level. Only problem is this is where we've been pulling all of the good stuff. Is there anything that remains? Boom shakalaka, we did it again. What an earring day. Hagen does. Has been unlocked. I think we got silver right here. That is awesome. All right, so this one, see the 925 there, GMGM. -GM. No. GWCH, what the hell does that mean? It's got the blah blah blang blah blang blang blah blang 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 blah blang 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 blah blang blang blah blah blang. Honestly, think I was going to forget about the spreadsheet? No, 48 boom shakalaka.
Man, more beach glass. This is the old type. You don't see stuff like this anymore. What is this? It's like the Pizza Hut hat. Is it a hat on top of a Pizza Hut? The roof. It's a quarter. Apparently, we're getting closer to the fishing gym. I found a fishing weight. Zinkins. Man, th this rang up as a 12. I think I just got an old boule. Bullet. Cool. Nickel. It's a quarter. I'm in the water. Nickel and I can't feel my fingers. All right. I think we're calling it a day. So that was fun until the hands started freezing. Oh yeah, the blurry camera. Come on, Meryl, come on. Oh, great. Born smooth, born smooth. All right, there we go. At least we're getting a clear picture. So, fun day, guys. Good night, good night. <laughs> oh, bother. Look at this, it's, it's snowing again. This is madness. We don't want snow. Go away. Go away, snow. Shaking my head. Hello? Hey, uh, I got a ring today. Uh, you, you, okay. want, you want Taco Bell? Nah, sure. <laughs> was that a no or a sure? That, that was from mom. Huh? Uh, can I have three... Five soft shells because I'm actually that hungry. Five soft okay. shells because you're not hungry? No, because I'm hungry. Oh, because you're hungry. Okay, I'll, I'll get you five. The only thing is we got dinner coming. Um, oh. The other thing I have to settle is I told Gabby I'd get her Wendy's. And I got another oh. car today. We got Wendy's. Oh, you got Wendy's. Sweet. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, so I'll take care of the Taco Bell then. Oh, five. All right, five, you sure you want five? Yes, I do. All right. Okay. Bye. There's the bell. It's Taco Bell time. Man, five burritos. Dude is growing. Pretty soon he's gonna be strong enough to swing an E-track. I'm okay. Five soft shell tacos, good God. Welcome to Taco Bell, how can I help you? Hello, can I have um, five soft shell tacos and um, two bean burritos with rice, please? Okay. And that's it. Do you want any sauce or anything to drink? Um. Hot sauce, please, and um, nothing to drink. All right, 1144, step one, I'll see you. Thank you. You're welcome. I hope they're not judging me for like all that food. They're like, this guy, man, he needs, he needs an intervention. Okay, we just had a rapid, rapid, rapid turn of events. I am going to be able to get my COVID vaccine. It seems, I mean, I'll believe it when I see it. I've been on the li I've been eligible for weeks. Uh, they've been calling el uh, educators in New York, and uh, you know we're going back to school very, very soon. Uh, right after the President's Day, uh, President's Week break. Um, so I, I have uh, we, we've been trying on the computer. My wife Maya actually signed me up. I'm heading to the site right now to get my vaccine. I'm excited. It's like unlocking something. We have followed the maze and arrived. 34 minutes later. <laughs> it hurt, okay? It hurt. <laughs> my shot hurt. And they didn't give me a lollipop. I told them that I unlocked a lollipop. They wouldn't give me a lollipop. <sighs> Humanity. 
Let me get my composure, then we'll do a wrap up of all the fun stuff we found today. Sweet mother of pearl. I was expecting a lollipop. At least they gave me a band-aid. In all seriousness, it, it was fine. And uh, I'm happy to get it. Other than the lollipop. Well, that was an exciting day. All right, let's see. I got a buck 65 in clad. So let's do what we do with clad. Let's put it in here. The rest of the coins were Zinkins. This one might be salvageable. Let's see if it goes through Coinstar. And the other one, we the other ones we are going to do what we do with Zinkins. Bye. And yeah, we got some other yunk. This was from previous hunt. Um, sea glass. I don't know how I feel about that yet. Um, I'm warming up to the idea, but I, I like hoard everything else. Um, this was plated, but still pretty nice. This, it has no engravings that I see. So I'm going to have to test that. It's got weight to it. It definitely has weight to it. Um, gut feeling though that it's stainless based on the fact that there's no engraving anywhere that I see. Then again, my eyes are not too reliable. Um, I can't find the other part of this. I found one of these yesterday. I found the other one. And bling number one. Oh, and I see an engraving there. There is an engraving. We'll have to take a close look at that. Let's put that there. And where's the other one? Here we go. Got another one like that. This one is going to be silver. Yeah, this one is going to be silver. The, uh, there, we, there it is. The little point broke off. But I'm excited about this one. That one could be actual gold. Then there is the ultimate. I mean, this is like wearing a chandelier, okay? Like, you wear this. That's a chandelier. You're like a walking chandelier. But you know me, and you know me in rings. This one, I do believe, is Skilva. It's got that those little gold, goldish... You know, it's got the goldish look to it, but I'm going to have to do electrolysis on this. And it'll turn out to be a nice ring. Very cool. And, oh yeah, the chain. Forgot all about the chain. This, you can see. Mm, plated, if anything. Yeah, the color changes. It's not consistent. And the thing about plating, is, and it's, it doesn't have the weight. Um, the thing about plating is you could test it. You know, I, I, I could scrape it here and test it. And it just, it, it's not going um, it, to, it'll come out, it falls positive. You know, because it, if it's plated, there's gold there. And very little. So, anyway, I'm happy with this. This was a good hunt for the middle of the winter. And, uh... Many more coming. Okay, look, as of this moment in time, I'm 10,004 subscribers away from 20,000 subscribers. So if you don't mind, if we could get those 10,004 tonight, you know, just hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet. But, um, you know, no pressure. You know, 20,000, we're, we're looking forward to that, okay? So, thank you for your help. Ready? All right, I'm going to count down for you. All right, if you're not subscribed, okay? Ready, set, go.